Well, we are getting word of a major headway achieved in massive backlog of criminal cases weighing down Harris County Court. Fox 26's political reporter Greg Grugan is live in the newsroom to tell us just how much ground local prosecutors have regained. Yeah, hey Caroline and Rashi, there's an old saying that goes progress if not perfection. And that's an appropriate description of the laudable work accomplished by a district attorney's office that's undeniably understaffed. There is not a day that myself or my husband doesn't cry for him. The anguish of Barbara Virapin, a, a grieving mother who suffered for five years waiting for her son's killer to be held accountable in a Harris County court. I, I don't want to see any family go through this. I do not want to see any family to take this long for trial. It is a brutal consequence of an unprecedented crime wave driven case backlog. A massive pileup of pending cases. District Attorney Kim Ogg says her prosecutors have reduced substantially. To reduce the backlog, you have to work, our team has to work at 100% Plus, Og says through a combination of staff overtime and Herculean commitment, the total case backlog has been reduced 21 percent from 145,000 in June of 2021 to 114,000 today with 119 murders and capital murders cleared this year alone. We never get down to zero. What we're trying to achieve is pre Harvey levels. And we're not there yet. Og says more rapid reduction is limited by the size of her staff. Just 330 prosecutors serving the needs of more than 5 million Harris County residents. We are the lowest staffed office of the top 20 largest DA's offices in the country. Our caseloads are terrible. For Og and her team, the ultimate goal is reducing the amount of time to prosecute cases to pre-Hurricane Harvey levels. That is one year for misdemeanors and 18 months for more serious felonies. In the newsroom, Greg Grugan, Fox 26 News.